artists! My name is Megan and I'm here today with the art card to tell you about the amazing project we'll be making this week. We're making something really cool and I actually see one of our projects flying by over here. Look at that. Now there's a second one of them too. Look at them go. We're going to be making coffee filter butterflies and these also will be hung in the window when you're done so they can catch sunlight and look beautiful up in your window. All right, let's get started. The materials you need will include two coffee filters, markers, a spray bottle, a clothespin, a glue dot, and a paper plate. Your first step will be to take one of your coffee filters and draw all over it with your markers. You can see I drew a rainbow across mine but you can draw whatever you would like to draw. This is your artwork. Some of the things that can be helpful are if you do big blocky shapes and put colors next to each other, because later we're going to spray our coffee filters with water and that will make all of our different colors meld together in really interesting ways. You can see I'm also going to add some spots in between my lines because I want to see how those interact with the water once we add the water. But you can make whatever you want. So now you can see I'm taking my second coffee filter and I'm about to draw all over that one. But I'm going to do something a little bit different where I'm going to fold it in half first. So I will only be drawing on one half of my coffee filter. And you can see with this one, I'm trying to use more big, blocky shapes with more color in them because I want to see how that ends up looking, too. This is all about experimenting because butterflies come in lots of different colors and shapes and patterns. Now your next step will be to spray your coffee filters with your water bottle that you can see there. So hold your water bottle above your paper plate and really gently mist them. You don't want to put too much on and you can already see the colors are starting to bleed into each other a little bit. You can go all the way around and really try to get the whole thing. After that, you can let your coffee filters dry and come back when they're completely dry. Some of you may be wondering if you have extra siblings or if you need more water in your bottle, how to fill your bottle with water. So the top of it just pushes off so you can push on the side and it'll push the top of the bottle off and then you can fill it up with more water if you need to do that. Now you can see both of my coffee filters are completely dry and you can see on this coffee filter my drawing actually transferred over to the other side of the paper. So the next step is going to be creating an accordion fold, which means folding your paper back and forth a bunch of times really tight. So you can see I'm doing it right there and you can always ask an adult for help if you need. But you just want to make thin lines of your coffee filter and then fold them back and forth on those lines. You can do the same thing with your second coffee filter and those will make either the top or bottom wings of your butterfly. Now your next step will be to bunch up your coffee filter in the center and then pull your accordion wings out and then you can set it in the center of your paper clip by opening up your paper clip. So I'm making these ones my bottom wings and these ones will be my top wings so you can see I'm pushing the center in and then pulling the sides outwards. So once I put them both in, I can pull the wings out a little bit more. And there we have it. That's my butterfly. Wow, look at my butterfly fly around. Now the only other thing is there is a small glue dot in your bag. It looks like a folded piece of paper, so you can pull that out and put it onto your paper clip, and then you can hang your beautiful butterfly in the window for everyone to see. Thank you so much for watching this video. I hope you learned a little bit more about drawing with markers and making butterflies. Be sure to check out our social media and send us pictures of what you made. We love to see 
what you all create. Now, if only I could find where my butterfly went off to. There he is. All right, everyone, have a wonderful week.